Internet is one of the most technical achievements of our time. But this technology is not new. Its idea goes back, back to the 1960s due to the work by Paul Bellen and Don Davis on pack switching. So around 1970s, TCP IP protocols were invented. But since then, it's already about 50 years. It has been very successful. But right now, new applications are coming up, are emerging. For example, holograms, holographic type of communications, vertical industries. So what they need is something the current internet cannot support. For example, the current internet can only support best effort services, differentiated services, and traffic engineering. But it doesn't guarantee throughput or latency. For example, like in autonomous driving, in some machine critical applications, we need guaranteed latency. And in some other applications, we do not allow packet is lost. So current network is, lost, lost, uh, is lossy. So when you send a packet out, the packet can be lost. So we want the future network to be lossless networking. So the third is that because holograms need a very high throughput, usually like a person like me this size, it requires more than four terabit per second. But according to the TCP IP, in order to have a high throughput and your network is lossy, so your latency has to be very short. So those are, there are some contradictions there. So on one hand, we need a high throughput. On the other hand, we need a very low latency. So these two requirements cannot be met that together. So Network 2030 will try to solve such problems there. It's a long journey from here to get there. So it needs a community to work together from different countries. I think ITU has made a very good step by setting up this focus group. So far, we have worked together for about uh, like, uh, like seven to 10 months. We have made a tremendous progress. People have agreed to the problems we have identified. For example, can the internet is the best effort for the future. We need the best guaranteed, best precision and services, so we need uh, like a lossless networking. We also need uh, something new, that's a holographic type of communications. For example, like a holographic concert, one singer sings in a city, his band plays in another city, so his dancers perform even in third city, so we can teleport the hologram to one place, we can have holographic concerts there. So right now we have identified those services and uh, drawbacks, limitations from the internet. And also we have many like uh, work, uh, workshops here. People just propose their solutions. So right now we have, you know, know how much and where the direction we are going. Currently we are working on some solutions, hopefully in the next year. So the solution will be coming up. As I see that, so people have like made a few, like four to six competing solutions, either at layer two or layer three and layer four. So we also in the architecture group, we have already identified some issues, for example, like a private internet and a public internet. So many nets are emerging. So how to uh, converge them together, sometimes how to select the best path like to forward the packet from one place to another to guarantee lossless networking, latency guaranteed, high throughput, trustable infrastructure.